that much. Oh. And I, I'll admit that. Yeah. But maybe it's the algorithm. So maybe I kind of came off a little strong. Yeah. I might want to help. But why, why do you think that is that the algorithm comes off with only the OnlyFans girls or well, only the kind of like social media models? Well, we brought women in from different types of professions doctors, lawyers, estheticians, different types of professional but fields. I'm, I'm asking. I'm going to explain yeah, yeah, yeah. that. The thing is, is that typically the smarter women don't say as much. It's the dumb ones that are loud. Those are the ones that get the clips. Okay. And then that's how you see it on your feed, and you're like, oh my god, this OnlyFans girl. What? But the reality is that that's just one girl on the panel versus okay. the other girls are silent. The memorable ones are the idiots, and those tend to be the, the OnlyFans girls. See, if you watch it, then you should know that like a majority of the girls are not OnlyFans girls. Some are, but not a majority. Can we pull out the stats in the different career fields, actually? Yeah. So yeah, a majority definitely aren't OnlyFans girls. Those are just the people that you remember because those are the ones that like go viral. Okay, I don't talk so that's why I'm YouTube asking. shorts, Instagram, people put our stuff everywhere. Yeah, yeah. What, what made you ask this question though? I mean, do you agree or disagree? I think everybody has their own path. I don't really think women should marry young before 24. Yeah, but there are tried and true paths though that just simply work. For example, if I want to be a doctor, there's a path for that. I can't just sit here and say, yeah, oh, I, I have my own path. Like, no, you got to go to med what school. What does that have to do with marriage, though? Because I'm going to go to law school, too. Me, personally. Yeah. But what does that have to do with marriage? Like, Okay, so do you think that your law degree or you becoming a lawyer is going to dictate your ability to find a man? No. Okay, so wouldn't it be fair to say that like a woman's career isn't that important as they think it is to finding a man i think they're two separate things yeah but you do understand that pursuing the career directly puts the other one in jeopardy for example i don't agree with that you don't agree with that okay why do you not agree with that? i think that if you're pursuing a career you're gonna find someone that's aligned well if you're trying to be a lawyer you're gonna be working pretty hard right yeah you're gonna be studying. Yeah. Then you're gonna maybe make partner up one day or whatever. You're gonna be working a lot of hours, right? And I assume, me personally, that your partner, as I have my partner, I assume that you're making that plan with them. So you guys are kind of aligning your lives with. Do you think men want to date someone else that's career oriented like them? Maybe, maybe not. I'm Would you want to date a guy that takes longer to get dressed than you and gets his nails done every week? and maybe wears high heels on Sundays. But that has nothing to do with being I'm career going I'm going somewhere with this. Would okay. you want a guy that does that? I wouldn't mind. That wears if, heels? I mean, wears heels, that means that they're probably not sexually oriented uh, as I am, maybe. You mean as in they're not heels? masculine? They're not masculine. But, that but that's not attractive, right? But that statistically aligns with being sexually oriented. Yeah, I don't know what you just said, but I, the, what I'm trying to describe here is that you don't want a feminine man, correct? I don't, I've been with some men. It and how did that work out? I just left because I was going through my own personal things, but yeah. So you didn't find them attractive. What I'm trying to say here is no, that yeah, men well, don't, I don't care. Feminine men and masculine men, that's not what we're talking about. We're talking about marriage. I'm trying to, and trying you're a partner explain. personally. You're a personal, your personal preference okay. as a partner. Let me be very blunt about this. Okay. Men don't give a fuck about a woman's career. And the reason why we don't is because we don't want to date ourselves. So you getting a law degree, and rising up the ranks and making partner one day doesn't make you sexier. No, but but here's the problem. Women think that their career defines their their value. This is why men typically want younger women. We don't care about your career and your money and everything else. We don't want to date ourselves. If I'm a lawyer as a guy, why would I want to date a girl that's also a lawyer that's not going to have time for me? The reason why is because you don't see women as women. You don't see women as a human. You see them as a person that's going to give birth to a... You see them as a breeder. You see them as someone that's going to give your child and is going to be a, a housewife. And that's fine if a woman wants to be that. So you don't want to be a housewife? There's about, I don't want to be a housewife. I want to be a mother. And you can be both. You can be both. I don't know where this conversation came from that you can't be both. See, this is one of the feminism so can, lies. Yes. But I can't be a mother and have a career. No. Because it's my job to provide and protect. It's your job to nurture the child. Okay. And if you're working at work all the time, you can't nurture the child. You want to be a lawyer, right? Yeah, but I'm you not working You do understand that being a lawyer. My, I work as a legal assistant and my boss is a partner. She owns her firm with her husband, yep. who is also a partner. Uh-huh. Did she cut her hours back? Just the same as her husband. Her husband comes in later because he drops off the kids. She comes in earlier and she leaves earlier. Okay. Because she goes so to she, pick up so, the kids. So she went ahead and prioritized the kids then? She put the back, the but so law firm. The, but so did the father. He probably because works. he came in later. He came in at 12 o'clock to drop off the kid. I guarantee you. He I probably works more hours. No, he, he doesn't. He doesn't hours. because I'm his assistant. And even, I'm both of their assistants. You can't, you're gaslighting right now.
Yeah. I'm not gaslighting. You're no, just being you emotional. Are because I'm not being you're, emotional. You're being very emotional. I, Men don't care about women's careers. I get because you. Because you don't. Why do you look for a career? Did you have a dream to be a provider? Or are you because you have a career? Men, you have a dream to be more. more. See, you can't ask me a question and then let me answer. Men have to provide. Women don't have to. That's the difference. If you're a bum. Your ability to find women is going to be tarnished. But as a woman, if you don't have a job, you can still find a guy to take care of you. Those will work the same way. But that's how it's been built. I know, but that's my point. I wish I could dismantle but that's it my the point. way that you want to dismantle No, I'm not trying to dismantle it. I think we need to keep it. I think women shouldn't work. I think they should be at home. I don't think so, because women have more to give than to just child, we... Raising a child is the most important thing a woman can do, by far. But fathers also have a role in that. And mothers also have another role in the world. How many inventions have women made? I don't even None. have the statistics. None. That's no, I can tell you, because I've talked about this. I've invented 90 plus percent of inventions that you enjoy. Women don't invent anything. They need to be home with kids, because even when they do get jobs, they get air-conditioned, cushy jobs where they're just sitting behind a desk. They don't work real hard jobs a lot of times. And here's the thing, too. You're saying, oh, career, career, career. You just admit it. Like, I don't, like, most women don't even want a career. Because some do. A majority don't. But some do. And why is that going to count off all other women? Because they, they've been lied to. It's not they until they get older than they wake up and realize that this was so a waste of time. So because I want to be a lawyer, I've been lied to. Yes, feminism lied to. That doesn't have anything to do with feminism. I have a dream. Where, where did that go? And where'd, and where'd you get that dream from? From being raised as a as a human with my own with my own dreams with my own self of sense of self guys it's so deep that she doesn't even know that feminism is what has programmed her to think this way yes feminism has psyoped women like you to think that pursuing to be equal so if because men and women aren't equal we're not equal we're not yeah we're not psychologically, physically, yeah. but we're still human. I'm still a human, and I deserve the same things that you should Focusing on me. kids. Women should be focusing on kids and raising a Fuck family. No. Wow. wow. The majority of women would prefer to stay at home and raise kids than Fuck work no. a career. Okay, even if that's true, the majority, so where, do that, where does that other minority lie? They're, they're discarded. They don't matter? So the minority of men who don't want to be providers, they don't matter? About men that don't want to be providers? Well, again, that's a problem because of feminism. The feminism is affected okay, both genders. That's a, that's a political propaganda that's happened that's above all of us. None, neither you or I or any of us have anything to do with the pro political propaganda that has become part of the system. Well, you can choose to accept the propaganda or understand how no, things really work. You've accepted the propaganda. I haven't. You have. You're indoctrinated Why? by feminism. Why do you think that? You're you literally talking about... Talk to I've been listening no, to you very you, closely. You've just been trying to drown me with your thoughts. That's what you've done. No, I'm just saying that you've been indoctrinated by feminism. And Why? Okay, happened. Why have I been indoctrinated? Because you're pursuing a career over family and you think that... I, I'm not, though. I have a man. I'm 22. Who says we're not going to have children? Who says that when I become a lawyer and I pass the bar exam and I'm a lawyer and I have my own firm, I'm not going to be like, okay, I have enough right. money to... Decide. You said tomorrow, quit law school and let's focus on having a family. Would you quit? Maybe, yeah. Maybe. There you go. So if he if he had enough, go. if he had enough to support us, because it, does he have enough to support us? And I quit my job, and we have no no money. I'm not gonna raise my child with no money. My parents came here as immigrants, and they want a better life for me. Not because my parents came here with. I'm sure your parents came here with the same. So you made this whole brand, Fresh and Fit Podcast. Sorry, to bring more for your family, correct? Yeah, but I'm a man. That's my so duty. So why can't I? I'm the oldest child. What if I'm the only child? No, that's great, but I think women so should be prioritizing. I saying, live here in Miami, and I'm, I'm trying to tell you. I do actually live no. here. No, you, were you born? Were you were you born here? Actually, live here. No, were you born here? What that's does that have to do with anything? Let me let me fix my phrase. Sorry. Were you born and raised here in Miami? Okay. This is okay. Were you born and raised here? And I made one concrete argument. Yeah. Were you born and raised here? Answer my question. No, you weren't. So you don't know the culture like I do because I was born and raised here. And men here are influenced by men like you. And you know what they look for? They look for a girl who, what can they bring to the table? They look for a girl who, I don't know, but then guess what? They're in the passenger seat of their best friend's car, renting a fucking Lamborghini, going to Sexy Fish who means nothing to me. Having these conversations, I don't want a man that says that all I abhor to the world where are you going with this? 
women only need to be housewives and breeders. Maybe. I think they need to be prioritizing family and children, not a career. Who says that they can't you do can't both, though? Can you do you both? So you then you, okay, so then we're, we're, we're at the same level that men who, men are not fathers. They're just providers and they just make money and men are just mothers. Yes. The woman, are the woman stays home and the man goes to work. So men are not That's fathers. Men are not fathers and they have no, if you. That is if, being a father. If, no, it's not. It's not. It's, and the whole, wow. I can't even.